You may be curious, what's the difference between gene therapy, cell therapy, and gene editing? And why are they usually mentioned together? Well, all three are fields of research with similar goals in mind. Treat disease by changing the blueprints to our bodies at a microscopic level. Our genetic makeup. But how do they do it? That's where the differences lie. First, let's talk gene therapy. It's the introduction, removal, or change in genetic material, specifically DNA or its molecule cousin RNA, in the cells of a patient to treat an inherited or developed disease. There are a couple ways gene therapy can be administered. Typically, genetic material, such as a working copy of a gene, is transferred into the cell. Once in the cell, the transferred genetic material changes how proteins are created, so they can do the work for the gene that's not functioning. Proteins are the building blocks of how we function, so they make a big impact on our health. A vector, which is often a virus, delivers the gene into the cell. Don't worry, the viral genes that could cause disease are removed. Then the vectors are directly injected into the patient's body. The new working gene is able to alter the behavior of the protein within the cell, whereas cell therapy uses living and sometimes genetically modified cells to help treat a disease. These transferred cells can be from the patient or someone else. Cell therapy is routinely administered through blood transfusions. Genetically modified cell therapy is when a cell is removed from the body and the gene inside is altered, and then it is put back in the body. This combines components of gene and cell therapy approaches. For more on that, here's Dr. Rain Rouse. An example of this approach is CAR T-cell therapy. We take an immune system cell, usually a T-cell, and we introduce a new gene into the cell carrying a specialized receptor that's been trained to only target molecules that are on the surface of cancer cells. Large numbers of these change cells are grown in the laboratory and then returned to the patient's body so that they can kill cancer cells. You also may have heard of CRISPR, or zinc finger nuclease, which are types of gene editing. Gene editing is an up-and-coming approach that works with gene and cell therapies. There are no approved gene editing treatments yet, but many are currently in preclinical and clinical trials phases. The goal of gene editing is to remove or correct faulty elements of the DNA within the gene. This can be done either inside or outside the body, using the patient's own cells or donor cells. Gene therapy, cell therapy, and gene editing are ways to treat diseases at different microscopic levels of the body. For more information about these approaches and how they work, visit ASGCT.org.